Hi, this is Joe again with another review. In this video, we're going to be discussing a real classic movie. It's a 1963 uh, Jerry Lewis movie, uh, The Nutty Professor. And of course, of course, stars Jerry Lewis. And this is the original version I'm going to be reviewing. And I'm going to be reviewing the uh, remake, starring by Eddie Murphy. Uh, there was a pretty chunked up, uh, usually, remix is usually bad. I'm uh, not knocking any Murphy's version, it's just that usually remakes are usually bad. Uh, well, the 1963 version of The Night Professor was well, so Jerry, Jerry Lewis as like this nerdy, uh, geek, I guess you could say geeky college professor who wanted to make him a formula to make him look, look good, especially uh, towards women. And it works. Only temporarily. Uh, it's only, uh, it was only like a temporary fix, and after a couple of hours, he goes back to what he was, what he was before, with his crazy voice, with his buck, buck teeth, uh, and and all that type type of thing. And of course, he's judging the you know, the moles of it's re really good idea to do this. And of course, he decides he to continue doing it until, of course, he gets caught at the big dance saying, Yes, he did this thing. And of course, he still and ne never got fired from his job at the, at the college he was working at because uh, the dean of the school said, Okay, no more, uh, you know, exper your own personal experience was to work on what we tell you to work on, and that's it. No more personal stuff, using our resources to for your personal gain or and all that type of thing. And Jerry, but he says the heck with it. I want to do this thing, and he did some research at first. It's almost kind of like like a Jekyll and Hyde type type of experiment, you know. Uh, and you know it's probably a comedy. He said, "Okay, what's the comedy here?" And the only real comedy stuff is is when he. Place to work for, first before he works on his formula, he was working on a gym and there's the physical stuff there, and maybe some other physical stuff with um, where he was changing back and forth. There was some physical humor there, but other than that, the, the, the laughs I felt it was the first time I saw this movie and in, in, in the movie here last night, so I figured, hey, and that was one of the night, and so very, very few, few of any uh, of Jerry Lewis films. And since yesterday was Labor Day, 2017, I figured that people, and also he just died on August, passed away on August 20th. So I figured it would be an appropriate time to do a tribute to Jerry Lewis and to have uh, air some of his more classic films. And they, they show very few of the more than Lewis movies. Uh, which is, you know, which is kind of a change. I remember like the one talking movie that Jerry Lewis started in with D. Moore. But the majority of the movies that were shown on TCM and I think movies uh, channel, which is the over the year movies uh, station, uh, they show maybe the one talking Jerry more than Lewis film. Most of the films they show was just Jerry Lewis by himself. And of course, they always show you know, the Night Professor because it's the one that, you know, maybe Jerry Lewis himself said that it's one of his personal favorites. And it's, and because he actually do it, I believe he actually directed this. This film as well, so he had not say what's going on. Of course, the problem with the movies like this is I'm not knocking the, the movie itself. Is that the people in the movie have to be like brain dead? Not know the difference that the uh, the, uh, the version that when the professor turns into the the star called uh, Billy Love. Uh, when he becomes the Billy Love character, is exactly like I mean, there's not that much of a change except for maybe the hairstyle, the glasses, and the buck teeth. It's Jerry Lewis. I mean, how can you not know the difference between the Professor character and the Billy Love character? I mean, I mean, you have to be like brain dead <laughs> not not to see the difference. It's almost kind of like the stuff with. Um, it's cross-dressing movies. I mean, you, you, I mean, you have to. I mean, you can't tell the difference. I mean, I mean, come. I mean, it's like uh, 
So it's quite stressful when we say previously review like Yanto or Tootsie. I mean, you can't tell the difference. I mean, of who that is. I mean, come on. Um, and the same thing I found this one because you see so many of these tapes, tapes of films like in the early eighties, and it's like, hello, can you not tell the difference of who the, who who this is? I mean, come on. You can't t you can't tell this is a professor. I mean, come on, it's the same face. I mean, the same cleft in the chin. I mean, I mean you can't you can't tell the difference. I mean, how dumb are these people in this movie and they can't tell and that was uh, Jerry Lewis. And there was the professor the the, the new, this geeky professor is the same guy who was filling with me in this bar. I mean how how can how can you not tell the especially when his when the form that started to wear off and he starts speaking with a geeky voice and I'm like Come on, you people, you can't tell who it is. I mean, come on, come on, you stupid morons. You can't tell who this is. And that, that's how I, I mean, it's like completely different from, from the Eddie Murphy remake because any movie remake, like a fast suit, was a completely different look. I, I mean, you can't tell that was, I mean, you can tell, you know that's Eddie Murphy, but it's Eddie Murphy in a fast suit. I mean, it's such a dramatic change. Compared to when you have the Jerry Lewis version, which of course is the same body type. And he didn't get thinner or fatter or whatever. Just that uh, his face changed. His, his style might maybe change. I mean, it's very typical Jerry Lewis look with the slick back hair and the smoking and uh, you know, the voice and say what. I mean, it's the same guy, people. It's the same guy. It's the same. It's the same damn guy. I mean, you can't really, can't tell. I mean, that that was, that was the point that I had when I was watching this movie. But it is. Uh, and that's why you don't want to knock Jerry Lewis because the man just passed away I and mean, we gotta love him, you know, then the man rest in peace, but the other people in the movie have to be like green dead, not, not, not the same Jerry, uh, the same, the, the Billy Love, uh, is the same character as a, as a geeky professor, I mean, it should be called the geeky professor instead of the nanny professor, because the, the, because the professor character was such a geek. Uh, because the way he spoke was one of the stereotypical voice types of annoying voices that Jerry Lewis did in his long career, and of course he acted like and the, and the Billy Love character is like Jerry Lewis when he acts on his telephones. You know, a straight, really straight character over the top, um, you know, being rude to people and that, and that type of thing, and, and that's why he. That Billy Love character was like an over the top, really over the top type character, and but the movie is enjoyable. If you're a Jerry Lewis fan, you're gonna like this film. Uh, I don't have a problem with this film overall, except for the people of Brain Dead, not to know the difference. But other than that, uh, I recommend I recommend this film. I mean, it's one of the few Jerry Lewis films I saw all the way through, and, and I think it's not that bad. I mean, it's not, I mean, it's not the greatest movie I've ever seen in my life, but it's not. For, for a Jerry Lewis fan, of course, you gotta see this movie. Not only are there more than Lewis films, but you gotta see this one as well. It's one of the. Uh, after the breakup, the, the more than Lewis breakup, see this one first. Uh, because this one is quintessentially his most defining role after he broke up his relationship, his partnership with D. Moore. This is, I, think, I think this is the best one. Uh, of course, you see the King of Comedy as well. I haven't really fully seen that, so it's one of like a pieces now. But start off, with, start off with the Night Professor if you want to see a, a straight more uh, Jamie Lewis movie. I say start with this one first. Uh, and of course, dedicating dedicating this video to of course the late great Jamie Lewis. God bless him. That, God bless him and rest in peace. And he would never walk alone. Uh, so, of course, I'll be review of the Night Professor. Please click on the video, please read it. Feel free to comment on it. Please subscribe to my channel and please forward this video on your Facebook pages. You can check out all my videos and on my YouTube channel at rallyc.com. It's all WDY, rallyc.com. There's a home page in the Rally Reviewer. Christine Moore, and please check out all of his videos on his website as well. Thanks for watching and catch you next time.